Hello, hello, hello. Um, so, um, last Sunday, I played Winnie the Pooh, um, which you can hear in the background. And I couldn't figure out how to get 100%. And I figured it out, and, and I'm here to tell you how I did it. So, this is an intro... This will be an interesting video, I hope. And I hope it helps you get 100% uh, on Winnie the Pooh. Uh, the Game Boy Color game that was released in 1994, I think. Or maybe no, 2000. So, um, bah, 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 bah. I have my controller here, so I'm playing on a controller I used to. I first completed it also on the Game Boy Color, um, like a pink one. Um, um, as you can see, I've already got 100%. Um, this only happens when you actually have completed the whole book so i'll quickly explain it to you so uh to get 100 percent, you need to first go up here first you 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 cannot do it in one playthrough you have to play it through uh a few times so you have to go down here do the kanga game um you have to discover all the mini games um and the most important part is um, you basically need to get all the books and all the mini games, and the rest will sort itself. Don't worry about anything else. The books you get by playing the stories, but you have to play them correctly. And the one that's the most difficult to get correctly is this one. This is the story uh, between um, Winnie the Pooh and Rabbit. It's a story about how they race. And basically, um, you have to... Um, it's, it's a game in two parts. And you have to or win um, both parts. Or you have to lose both parts. You have to do both. So you can only do one of the two in every playthrough. But it's important that you don't, because in my playthrough, that's what I did wrong. Um, in my playthrough, I played, um, I, I lost one, the, this first part. And then I won the second part. In my second playthrough, I won this part and lost the second part. And the, um, the way you unlock it is by losing both or winning both. So, um, in this case, we'll see if I lose or win. So, it's basically the dice game. Uh, if you want to know how to play the base game, um, have a look at my previous uh, video or, or have a look at the VODs. But it's basically pretty simple. It's a dice game. Um, basically, uh, what's it called? We call it Hansebord in Dutch. Um, but I'm guessing it's called something else in... Uh, in, in, in English, but goose board. <laughs> so basically you have to play through all the stories and then you have to play them again and get all the alternate endings. Um, so we need to get exactly on that star um, to win this. Ah. Okay, so we'll lose both. That's the easiest. <laughs> now, I've already done it. So now I lose. And basically, the end of this first part is always the same. Pooh gets stuck and he has to go fetch his friends. But um, you either have to lose both or win both. That's important to know. Um, voila, now he's eight. He's eating too much. And now we have to lose this second one. Because we've... Um, because you... It 
Doesn't matter if we get this next one, we don't get a book for it. Or you lose both, or you win both. Oh, we got one. Come on, Eeyore, come help us. Oh, but because we took too long, um, Pooh is already saved because he got a bit thinner um, whilst waiting. Voila. So that's how you, you have to now, we've lost both. Now you can also play it with, when you win both. But to play it again, you'll have to go through all the four stories. There are only four story levels. Uh, the second one is um, Piglet here. And Piglet um, is quite a simple one. Um, so it's a short one as well. So um, Piglet also has two endings. Um, that are valid. So every story has two el endings that are valid. Um, so uh, for this one, we need to um, basically run through it. Um, one time you have to catch Piglet. So you have to end up at, on, on exactly his spot. Um, and one time you will have to just let him run off the edge. Oh, not quite. We've got one more shot. Can we? Let's have a look at the map. Uh, we'll have to throw a six to catch him. Uh, five. Not quite. Oh no! Five was enough. We did it. We got him. We got him. Great. So. That one, you also have to lose once, win once. Um, to reset all the games, you'll have to go to the end. We'll do that in a bit. So, uh, the next one is Eeyore's birthday. You also have to win it once, lose it once. Um, the most complex one to get is the one with uh, Rabbit, the first one. Because you cannot switch around. You have to win both events or lose both events. Um... Which was my mistake before. So this one. There's a... To win it, there's a... You have to... Or at least my way to do it is... Yeah, that's not a great start. Um, that's actually a perfect start. Is if you get this, you've basically won. Like, that's that's the best move you can do. Um, yeah, you need a 1 or a 5 here at the end. There's no other solution. Yeah. Um, so if you get a 5 or a 1 card there at the end, that's always good. Anyway, if to win it once, lose it once to get both the books. Then, um, you can visit all the other places. Basically, you have to go this way. Along here. You have to do the mini game up there. So, up there at the tree, there's a mini game. Um, and here there's the, there's another story. Again, this one you have to lose once, win once. Um, so the first time you have to avoid Tigger and the second one, uh, uh, well, you have to avoid Tigger and then meet him or meet him before, before you, or he should catch you. Um, oh, that's too good. We have to go in here for a bit. Like. That animation is just amazing. He only rolled a one. And he went the other way. Oh. Okay, I think he's gonna catch us now. Not quite. Okay, if we throw a three, I'm going back into the bush. Okay, nope. <laughs> 
Uh, is he gonna catch us? He will definitely, yes. Okay. So that's one of the endings. The other ending is where you can get, stay away from him for 10 turns. Now, after that, you go down here to Robinson. If you don't have all the endings, he will just send you back to the beginning. If you do have all the endings, like me, he will. you will have this. So, welcome, Pooh. Hello, Christopher Robin. Oh my, Pooh. I'll say you collected eight books. That's wonderful. This is a present for you. And we get another book. This is basically the plot of uh, the Winnie the Pooh movie, the first one, I think. So it's Tigger looking for his family tree. If So he finds his family tree and um, he starts looking for family members. But there are no family members left. So he can't find any family members. Um, and his friends then find him in the snow. Um, and they run and jump toward him. Full of joy because they lost him. Um, so then we have Rue and Pooh happy to see him. Yeah. So he was expecting to find more figures like him. So Rabbit, who had been very worried about Tigger, got angry because Tigger was not grateful that they had found him. So they started arguing and their loud voices caused an avalanche. Come on, hurry it up. They all started to run away from the avalanche trying to reach safety. And then Tigger has to grab onto a big rock. But then Rue, also a jumper, saves him. With a super bounce. Dear Tigger, just a note to say. Dress warmly. This is also good advice for you guys out there. Dress warmly. Eat well. Stay safe and sound. And keep smiling. We're always there for you. Signed. Your family. Ah, oh, so all along they were his real family. Um. You're amazing, you know. Everything there is to know in this wood. Ah, you know everything there is to find in this wood. And that's the end. That's how you complete uh, Winnie the Pooh Adventures in the 100 Acre Wood. Um... <laughs> I'm a graduate of the 100 acre wood. Yeah. Um, so yeah. That's how you do it. And afterwards, you do end up in your home. Um, you can always also try to complete his home. I don't know if you also get a, um, get a chief for that. But you definitely get one. Uh, so here, um, you can see there are now... Two books for Pooh and Honey. So one win, one loss. The Flood Story win and loss. Birthday win and loss. The Rabbit's Plan win and loss. And then the Tigger movie. Voila. That's what I wanted to show you. And that's how you get 100%. Uh, on Winnie the Pooh Hunt Adventures in the 100 Acre Wood. Uh, one slight remark. If it doesn't say 100% there, it's because you didn't go to the end after complete after getting all the books. So after you get all the books, it will be 96% and you still have to go to the all the way to the end to um, Christopher Robin. So, I hope that helped you. And basically, that's all I wanted to show you. Um, so, I will see you... Um, next time. Bye.